Hey guys, it's Michelle. We're print oversized printing, so standard image size 10 by 12. This is more like 14 and a half. The first print that we're looking at is the Queen from the chess set. So it's a hexachrome model. It has CMYK RG, so this is a good representation of the red inside of the Maverick. The next one, uh, this is an auto set, so you're taking a transparent background PNG and just dragging and dropping into a folder. And you can see uh, some of the nice transitions at the bottom that faded off into the shirt and some of the fine details in the top that show all of the textures. The next one is a full control separation. So this one I separated. The automation is built into Photoshop, so it takes two to five minutes to create the separation. And it shows nice transitions to shirt. This is all transparency, and it fades really soft. And uh, we teach you how to do that. And it also shows off the hexachrome of the Maverick and the fire. The next one is a vector PNG, so auto separated, and you just drag and drop does really big format, nice solid bright colors. The next one is also an auto separation and it shows really nice fades to shirt. And then we played around with the choke to get the textures in his face to work out really nice. And it's blues that fade to shirt, which can sometimes be challenging. The next one we were trying to play around with glows and things that looked a little more fluorescent. So this is also an auto separation, transparent background PNG, just drag and drop. And this is what the Maverick will generate, about 18 inches tall. The next one combines together photo reel and vector and it's a transparent PNG, drag and drop. Did an auto separation, fades off to the shirt really nicely, has transparency all throughout. Uh, the next one is an auto separation. Again, drag and drop, transparent PNG. It doesn't really have any black in it. It's just printing the reds and the underbase, and it shows off the hexachrome really well. The next one is a full control separation. So I separated this in Photoshop using actions, and it takes two to five minutes. You push three different buttons. You adjust your white, and it prints out. The next one is a transparent background PNG, and it shows off some of the hexachrome, two different colors, um, and smoke. And then it shows all the transparency of smoke fading into the background. The next one um, is about 16 inches tall, and it shows really fine detail white stars fading off into the background, and transparent blues, light blues fading into the background. And then it has some dark blues in the stairs and in the bottom. And this is also auto sept. The next one is an auto separation. It's about 18 inches tall. It shows fire, um, some of the sparks, all uh, transparent background PNG. It's not printing a big square of black. It's just printing the transparent fading. You can see really fine details of the fading, which helps you save on digital ink. So the B is an auto separated from a transparent PNG, and then this is the underbase. So we printed the full design at the top, and then we printed just the underbase at the bottom. So you can see what the auto separated underbase is generating. The next one is a vector design. Uh, one cool thing about this, as opposed to screen printing, is that when you pull it, it doesn't turn into an oval, because there's no glue. This is an auto separation, transparent background, PNG, drag and drop. It does flames and dark colors. These two show off two different things that you can do with the Maverick. It's dark colors being printed uh, through an auto sep. And then this one shows an auto separation with a oil slick foil applied to the top. And you apply that and it gives it a nice metallic sheen. This is a full control separation. So I did this in Photoshop, two to five minutes, three buttons, all actions. We'll teach you how to do it. Um, it's 20 inches tall, 14 and a half inches wide, solid coverage. Again, uh, this is the fly. It shows the full uh, transparent PNG separation and you can see the transparency in the background of the leg fading off. And then in the bottom is the underbase that was generated through the auto set to do that and you can see the transparency here's a neon sign and this is auto separated no black it shows the transparency of the reflection on the wall it's not printing any black in there 
This is uh, full control. This one I separated two to five minutes in Photoshop. Um, and you can see all the nice hair and skin fades and transitionals. And it's about uh, 17 inches tall. And then to show you, this is transparency in the file. So all of this is transparency underneath of here. And you can see inside of the uh, separation file, there's a green background if I turn that on and off. That's my PNG, that's what the background, it's all transparency in the background. And then it generates the underbase correctly and it's not printing black or anything to create that. So we are printing on the Maverick and you can come check it out. This is an oversized print. It's about 17 inches tall. Auto separated, transparent background, PNG. Thanks guys.